If you find yourself wondering, what human food can my dog not eat, while trying to resist your pet's begging face, be sure to watch this video. While you can feed your dog some human food, certain things can actually be very dangerous for pets. In this video, we'll show you top 15 toxic foods to avoid feeding pets. Our animal poison control center experts have put together a handy list of the top toxic people foods to avoid feeding your pet. As always, if you suspect your pet has eaten any of the following foods, please note the amount ingested and contact your veterinarian or the animal poison control center. Number 15, tomatoes and raw potatoes. Tomatoes and potatoes fall in the category of safe in some forms, unsafe in others. A ripened red tomato is generally okay. However, the green parts of the tomato plant have solanine, which is toxic to dogs. Green, unripe tomatoes also have solanine. Potatoes are the same deal. If baked or boiled with no additives, they're generally safe in small amounts. But raw potatoes contain solanine, which is toxic to dogs. Number 14, alcohol. Alcoholic beverages and food products containing alcohol can cause vomiting, diarrhea, decreased coordination, central nervous system depression, difficulty breathing, tremors, abnormal blood acidity, coma, and even death. Under no circumstances should your pet be given any alcohol. If you suspect that your pet has ingested alcohol, contact your veterinarian or the ASPCA Animal Poison Control Center immediately. Number 13, Avocado. Avocado is primarily a problem for birds, rabbits, donkeys, horses, and ruminants including sheep and goats. The biggest concern is for cardiovascular damage and death in birds and rabbits. Horses, donkeys, and ruminants frequently get swollen, edematous head and neck. Number 12, chocolate, coffee, and caffeine. These products all contain substances called methylxanthines, which are found in cacao seeds, the fruit of the plant used to make coffee, and in the nuts of an extract used in some sodas. When ingested by pets, methylxanthines can cause vomiting and diarrhea, panting, excessive thirst and urination, hyperactivity, abnormal heart rhythm, tremors, seizures, and even death. Note that darker chocolate is more dangerous than milk chocolate. White chocolate has the lowest level of methylxanthines, while baking chocolate contains the highest. Number 11, Citrus. The stems, leaves, peels, fruit, and seeds of citrus plants contain varying amounts of citric acid, essential oils that can cause irritation and possibly even central nervous system depression if ingested in significant amounts. Small doses, such as eating the fruit, are not likely to present problems beyond minor stomach upset. Number 10, Coconut and Coconut Oil. When ingested in small amounts, coconut and coconut-based products are not likely to cause serious harm to your pet. The flesh and milk of fresh coconuts do contain oils that may cause stomach upset, loose stools, or diarrhea. Because of this, we encourage you to use caution when offering your pets these foods. Coconut water is high in potassium and should not be given to your pet. Number 9. Grapes and Raisins Although the toxic substance within grapes and raisins is unknown, these fruits can cause kidney failure. Until more information is known about the toxic substance, it is best to avoid feeding grapes and raisins to dogs. Number 8. Macadamia Nuts Macadamia nuts can cause weakness, depression, vomiting, tremors, and hyperthermia in dogs. Signs usually appear within 12 hours of ingestion and can last approximately 24 to 48 hours. Number 7. Milk and Dairy Milk and other dairy products should be considered on a case-by-case -case basis. Some pets can drink milk or eat dairy products just fine. However, some pets are lactose intolerant or allergic and may experience diarrhea and gas if they have cow's milk. Ice cream is also bad for pets because of the lactose, the high sugar, and high fat. Rather than giving your pet ice cream, try freezing bites of healthy fruits your pet can eat instead. As for cheese, it's okay in small quantities, but stick to lower fat cheese as a treat instead of high fat. Number 6. Nuts 
nuts, including almonds, pecans, and walnuts, contain high amounts of oils and fats. The fats can cause vomiting and diarrhea, and potentially pancreatitis in pets. Number 5. Onions, Garlic, Chives These vegetables and herbs can cause gastrointestinal irritation and could lead to red blood cell damage and anemia. Although cats are more susceptible, dogs are also at risk if a large enough amount is consumed. Number 4. Raw or undercooked meat, eggs and bones. Raw meat and raw eggs can contain bacteria such as Salmonella and E. coli that can be harmful to pets and humans. Raw eggs contain an enzyme called avidin that decreases the absorption of biotin, a B vitamin, which can lead to skin and coat problems. Feeding your pet raw bones may seem like a natural and healthy option that might occur if your pet lived in the wild. However, this can be very dangerous for a domestic pet who might choke on bones or sustain a grave injury should the bone splinter and become lodged in or puncture your pet's digestive tract. Number 3. Salt and Salty Snack Foods Large amounts of salt can produce excessive thirst and urination or even sodium ion poisoning in pets. Signs that your pet may have eaten too many salty foods include vomiting, diarrhea, depression, tremors, elevated body temperature, seizures, and even death. As such, we encourage you to avoid feeding salt-heavy snacks like potato chips, pretzels, and salted popcorn to your pets. Number 2. Xylitol Xylitol is used as a sweetener in many products, including gum, candy, baked goods, and toothpaste. It can cause insulin release in most species, which can lead to liver failure. The increase in insulin leads to hypoglycemia, lowered sugar levels. Initial signs of toxicosis include vomiting, lethargy, and loss of coordination. Signs can progress to seizures. Elevated liver enzymes and liver failure can be seen within a few days. Number 1. Yeast Dough Yeast dough can rise and cause gas to accumulate in your pet's digestive system. This can be painful and can cause the stomach to bloat and potentially twist, becoming a life-threatening emergency. The yeast produces ethanol as a byproduct and a dog ingesting raw bread dough can become drunk. That's all for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Let us know your thoughts in the comment section below. If you haven't already, then don't forget to subscribe and press that like button. Also hit the bell icon so you could never miss new updates from us. Thank you for watching and we will meet you in the next one.